take one. So I, I really think that the, the reason that, that Unity and WET are perfect partners really goes back to the foundation of both companies. Um, if you go back to the foundation of Weta and you know, Peter Jackson's genius, he realized that he wanted to make films that were impossible to make with the tools of the day. And he created tools that really enabled artists to do things that were heretofore impossible. Similar time frame, you go back and you look at Unity Technologies, and they weren't looking at the artists, they were looking to uh, the video game maker, the programmer, and they didn't have the tools to make what they needed to make. And so around the same time frame, Unity was creating groundbreaking tools that enabled programmers and developers to create new forms of entertainment. Same time frame, Peter was doing that with artists. And today, the most important works are a blend of developers and artists working together to create, whether it's great films, or it's great video games, or it's great so many other things. And so bringing these two things together is about as natural as anything as I can think of. I couldn't agree more. And, and the fact is, is you nailed it, which is going all the way back to the very beginning, which is what Peter saw in his mind was just not possible at the time. And creating those tools to actually do it stayed in our DNA all the way up to today. And it's the perfect time to, for a custodian like Unity to take that pipeline and bring that out to the entire world. What I'm most excited about is how many new voices out there are we going to create for current artists and, and also future artists and by enabling these tools and put them in their hands. And to build on that, you know, at Unity we say that, you know, we believe the world's a better place with more creators in it. Yeah. Um, if you go back a decade ago, we were talking about democratization. So Completely. giving powerful tools to ordinary people to make incredible things. And we celebrate the artist inside of Unity. Now, Weta is the artist, That's right. but they're also made the tools for the artist. That's right. So there is, um, it's an easy conversation to have because we've been having the same conversation from two decades before we met each other. That's exactly right. And I think that we, um, and we'll be, that's why we're gonna be the best client of this software. <laughs> and we'll be the number one client and the number one customer and client because you are going to, Unity will take those tools and make them so much more powerful and user-friendly um, than, than we could ourselves. And we can really focus on what we do best, which is creating beautiful, visually arresting, cinematic you know, television and film. I'll give you my picture of Weta. One of the most incredible creative forces on the planet. Um, the number of, whether it's Academy Awards or just some of the best film has ever been made. And deep in that organization, are a set of tools, a, a content creation pipeline that is used privately inside of Weta. Yeah. Now, it is the crown jewels of the film industry. People would do anything to get their hands on those tools to be able to do what Peter Jackson does so brilliantly. Yes. And while that's hidden inside of Weta, what's rising around us are not just hundreds of thousands, but millions and potentially billions of future creators. And Unity's lot in life is to take powerful content creation tools to the world. So by partnering up with Weta here, what we get to do is to take what they've been polishing for over 20 years and bring it to the rest of the world. I think we're gonna unlock a tidal wave of creativity around the globe. I couldn't agree more because our North Star, as you've perfectly articulated, has been creativity and artist, has been storytelling, has been what's on the screen. We've never been guided by anything else besides that. And it's really be the benefit of being founded by Sir Peter Jackson, of course. And so that's always been what we are in service of, no matter what we do. And now for, for, for to, to be able to have the influence uh, around the industry, you're absolutely right. Everybody wants their hands on these tools and we want to give it to them. And it's something that we could not do ourselves. And that's why you are the perfect partner, Unity, really because of what we looked at, which is that you have the three T's that we call it. You've got the t technology, the team, and the timing. The timing couldn't be better for our shared vision of empowering the, uh, new voices and new creators all around the world. Just to tease out a little bit about the, you know, when I first realized what a genius Peter Jackson was, I remember I got lost in reading Lord of the Rings in college. I was a little late, I guess, a late bloomer, but it was finals week, my freshman year, and I pretty How'd well- How'd you do on the exams if you're I reading tanked. Lord of the Rings? I read okay, yeah, man. all three books, Okay. finals week. <laughs> and it wasn't, wasn't my best performance. Time. And 
for the rest of my life, I carried an image in my head of, of, of what each character looked like, what they acted like, what they felt like. And just to use Golem as an example, I knew exactly what Golem looked like. I could smell what he was about. I do not know and did not know how Peter Jackson could read my mind and put <laughs> that on the screen. He created something from whole cloth in a collection of words. It's beyond brilliant. And he needed to create tools for that. There were no tools to deliver on that imagination. He spoke for the hundreds of millions of people that were affected by that story. And he gave it to us. Sheer brilliance and the power of tools. First of all, I envisioned Gollum the same way as you did, and there it was. And that is just absolutely, to, to Peter's credit, the tools is really what to, to focus on the first visual, the first uh, virtual character, which was Gollum, largely on a large screen. And people were so entrenched in the story, looking at the power of that tool to create Gollum. We got phone calls 20 years ago at Weta that said, where did you get that actor? Where did you get that person? And these are industry professionals who called up Joe Letary and called up Peter Jackson and said that. And that was such a testament to the tool itself and also the storytelling of using that tool. Again, in service of the story, people were so into the story, they didn't even realize that, of course, that's a completely CG character. Why is the timing so right? So in the last, I don't know, year or so, we've been hearing everywhere about the metaverse, yeah. about the way the world is going to change by this vague notion. And to me, the, the notion is not all that vague. It's yeah. the next generation of the internet. That's right. But instead of looking at a, uh, you know, an actor walking back and forth or looking at a picture, instead of us going to look in a shop window, we're going to be surrounded yes. by the environment created by artists in the next generation. That's right. They are going to bring us untold creativity and the, the power of the next set of GPUs and networks will enable that. But guess what? Outside of Weta, there are no tools for creating these imaginary worlds, these imaginary destinations in the metaverse. And one of the things I'm most excited about is I believe Unity can take Weta's tools to the world and enable literally, I believe, hundreds of millions of creators to change the face of creativity. It's going to unlock so much. These tools are going to sit at the foundation of the metaverse. That's right. And by the way, we were using these tools before metaverse was the new word of the day, right? We called them, mm -hmm. you know, it was the world that we built in Pandora, you know, for, for Avatar. It's Middle Earth for, for, for Lord of the Rings. And that immersive world, I was thinking about it flying over here this morning. It's like how I'm so involved in 2D on Instagram or whatnot. And I think about like, okay, five years, 10 years from now, how am I gonna be engaged in 3D art, in 3D creativity, in, in video, in, in, in stills, in that way? And that's what this tools can bring. And that, that's why I agree with you. I think it's hundreds of millions of creators who are gonna be able to use these tools in platforms that I can't even dream about right now. Yep. You know, one of the parts of this we look forward to is at Unity, we think it's our privilege to serve the world's greatest artists. And we get to do that in the video game industry. But to find ourselves in the situation as we are now, we get to serve the finest video effects organization on the planet to support them by ever advancing those tools, to stand, if you will, just a little bit left of brilliance and a little bit left of, of, of greatness and to know that we're part of it. We couldn't be more excited. And we, us as well, because honestly, we get to focus on what we're best at. We're the best in the world at shipping movies. You're the best of the world of sh shipping creator tools. And so now that marriage actually is, is, is it's truly the in alignment of interest because the better we do at what we do, the, the better the pipeline will become for, for future artists. It's exciting to me as, you know, I've, I've been in the entertainment business for the better part of a quarter of a century. And this is really the first time I've ever had a customer where I'm not sure if I want to ask them to give me their autograph or if I can help them solve a problem. <laughs> so there are so many talented I know folks exactly how you feel, by the way. And um, I've been following their careers for, for a, you know, a great long time. You know, I can't wait to meet Joe Letary and just 
like marvel uh, at what he's done. Uh, um, and of course, there's Peter, but there's so many others, and I, I, I'm looking forward to get to know them. Oh, absolutely. We've got dozens and dozens. I mean, that's the wonderful thing about Weta. When when artists come to Weta, they come to stay. And our tenure is almost 13 years long, which is which is about 13 times the average tenure in our industry. Uh, and so we, we've just been able to like nurture this talent and keep them. And it's just been, and the, and the effects are, are what we see on the big screen every day. If you don't have it in that, come on. No, yeah, no, it's, it's in there somewhere.